Hi, Lisa. Thank you. Another community facing damage in tornado last month is steadily recovering. Neil Zerang reporting live from North Little Rock on Sonora Drive there. Neil, how is the community there now a month out? Bob, Laura, it depends on who you ask and where you're looking. I've met a few people who have roughed it out almost the entire four weeks in their homes. Others don't plan to return or are awaiting repairs for their roofs. And if you look in a couple places, you'll see recovery already starting to begin. As water moves down the street and into homes, it feels like for some people time stopped March 31st. It's hard to see the end right now. Like, I didn't even know it had been a month. Yeah. It feels like it just happened. For weeks, it's been one task for Lindsay Hollick only to be replaced by another, from staying with family hours away to getting a hotel, rental car, and her children back in school. Now she's looking for a six-month lease apartment for her disabled parents as a structural engineer tells her what the family has to do next. Things look better but they don't and coming back every day to take care of the animals and stuff or just check on things it's this heavy pressure almost as strays or cats Hollock hasn't returned to work further down Sonora Drive Malachi Bailey was relocated by his job after tornado blew right over him inside it feels like your ears are just like burning and just ringing and it was just something I never seen or experienced before walking through his neighborhood he's unsure when it will recover for Hollock some things never will her neighbor was the only person in central Arkansas killed by the storm. I lost somebody I've known my whole life, and we couldn't help him. So that's really hard to come back and see, and you can't avoid it. But they will keep returning, leaning on each other to rebuild, no matter how many months it takes. It's going to be a long time before it's ever right again, or feels right. I don't know that it ever will be. A lot of strong people in this neighborhood. Just down the road on Military Drive, we've got Burns Park, which is still closed to this day. Plenty of trees down, and you'll see some trees down in this neighborhood. I got to hear from a few people who said their roofs are going to be replaced Monday. So lots of work still being done here, and that's the first thing that has to happen for a lot of these people before they can start repairing what's under their roofs. Reporting live in North Little Rock, I'm Niels Rang. Back to you, Bob and Laura.